everyone, welcome to my channel. I am Kima, a Jamaican born and raised farm girl living in Big City, Los Angeles, who loves all things fashion, beauty, and self-care. Now in this video, it's an H&M haul, just featuring some really fun, cute, casual tops. I'm going to mix those tops high and low, style them with high and low pieces, share them with you, and hopefully that will inspire you to elevate your casual style and your casual looks. So these are the tops. Let's get right into it. Let's try on these tops. <laughs> All right, so first up is this crop uh, top cotton blouse. It's kind of like really, really lightweight, which I love for summer. I love the tomato red color. It's super gorgeous, vibrant, just gives the right amount of vibrancy. And so I style it with my Levi's um, 501 90s jeans. I think that's what they're called. I'll put the name on screen. Style it with these jeans. I'm going to be styling all the tops with these jeans for a casual look. And my Monono Blonix shoes, kind of like black and white, gives a nice little polka dot to add some dimension and color to the look. Um, this crop top is super cute. I love that in the back right here. I can like tighten it if I wanted to. Like it could go tight like that. And it's not too cropped. It's a nice sized amount of crop. Uh, I'm 5'10 for reference. And so I could like kind of like get it a little bit tighter with this right here or I can just extend it back and keep it really, you know, then tight here and keep it really chill and loose. But I'm really loving this look. I grab my little Moschino bag. Um, I'll probably just change my earrings to some silver ones just for an elevated casual feel. So these are like kitten heels, which is not super dressed up. They're not like stiletto heels that are like really high. So it kind of just elevates a casual look, which I like. And just take the shirt to another level as if I, instead of like wearing just regular flats or tennis shoes. But love how it turned out. And this blouse, this top is really gorgeous. Next up is this white flounce trim top. Uh, what's beautiful and perfect, I think, about this top is the back details. Uh, it's just this gorgeous bow, which gives it a really nice feminine touch. I love that. And style it again, style in all my tops with these jeans. And I wore my Christian Dior block heels. It's kind of like blue, so I'm playing off the jeans. And to add like a pop of color, I would go with my Dior bag, this really fun, vibrant pink, which is really, really gorgeous. I love how it looks together. The top of this blouse is just so pretty. It's so cute. It's like your, you know, let's grab a quick breakfast or let's grab coffee or a quick movie date kind of look. So it's really casual, but elevated casual, mixed in the high and low pieces, like I always do with my outfits. and. It came out really good. I really, really love it. It's super light, super light. So perfect, perfect for summer. Okay, next up is this ribbed top. I love the little sweetheart cut it has right here. And the top is really cute. I went with this beige color. I think they have other colors. Just because it's kind of like really nice to have like neutral tones for summer. And the back is not a deep cut, but it's deep enough where it's still really chic. And I really, really love how it looks. I love how it looks with these jeans. And I started with my most worn designer shoes ever in life. I'll link the video here for you to check that video out, explaining all my, um, my top five designer shoes. And I work with these Valentino cage sandals. And I figured I could style it and elevate the look even more by adding my black color rancher hat for a nice little pop of accessories and my mini Valentino Rockstar bag to just add some extra color to the look, elevate it all, bring it all together in a little fabulous, nice detail. Um, yeah, I love how this look turned out. I love the simplicity of the top. Like I said, I love the cut right here. Really, really feminine and pretty and gorgeous. You can even add like a little scarf on your arm, around your neck, on your bag, if you wanted to add some more pieces to the look to make it even look more fab. But I'm fine with it as it is right here. I could do the hat, no hat, and um, it will still look really, really pretty. 
Love this top. This is also a fun one. Okay, so next up is this uh, blue, kind of like a light blue, silk-like v-neck uh, shirt blouse. And I have a couple deals in mind that I would like to style the shirt. First of all is, the, is my go-to, which is easily a half tuck. So I love a good half tuck on my shirts, tops, whatever it is that can tuck into my bottoms. I love a good half tuck because it just gives such an easy, quick way to elevate a look. So a half tuck, which I really, really love. And I was also thinking I could, since this scarf has like, you know, neat little blue details in it, I could easily just make like a, a round the collar type of look. I have a collar type of vibe to kind of like, you know, make it super fun. I think I'll, I could do that. I could easily tie it here too. I style this look with these Dolce Vita uh, rope sandals just to keep the neutrals going. And still keeping this Valentino mini rock stud bag with like the fun little colors to play off the blue and also off the scarf. I also think um, I could put the scarf on the inside too. So let's try it inside. So inside the collar is also still a really cool way to style a top like this. So you could leave it inside hanging out or I could tie it on the inside. So I could center it or I could put it to the side. And the bag. So just kind of like elevated the top and kind of like, it's like a nice, it's a dressy top, but if you just put it on with just your pants or your skirt or whatever bottoms you're wearing without like adding extra accessories, it can look a little bit simple, but if you wanted to elevate it in a casual vibe setting, that's why I style all these tops with, with the jeans. Um, this is a fun way to do so. And the silk vibe on this top is really fabulous. And it's absolutely gorgeous. Love this one too. Okay, so this last look is a t-shirt. <laughs> it's a t-shirt. I'm so not a t-shirt person, but when I was shopping these summer tops on H&M, I'm like, you know what? I should get like a cute t-shirt. And I picked this one UCLA because I did attend UCLA. I went there for my undergrad. Um, I got my bachelor's in anthropology. I started out as a psychology major and I switched to anthropology <laughs> and labor and workplace studies minor. So I got my bachelor's from UCLA, so go Bruins. And um, I decided I was gonna go with this top. It's also black, that's because I do have a beige UCLA sweater from H&M from last year, so I went with the black. Now, let's dress this t-shirt up. How do I make it fabulous? All right, so first of all, what I would do, this is actually a size small also, you guys, a size small, and it's thick. Uh, I would first cuff the, the sleeves, just so that it doesn't look so big anymore. I would cuff the sleeves. Um, muscle sleeves were in like two years, two, two, three years ago, even last year. And still this year, people are still wearing muscle sleeves. So if I wanted to, I could cuff it all the way and stuff it in the side, but I'm gonna keep it there. And now I'm gonna try also this style tip I learned on TikTok. Um, I'm literally gonna try it. So apparently you get like a bracelet, like a rounded bracelet like this. I'm gonna use it my Hermes little bangle. And you're gonna pull the shirt out, right? And you're gonna stuff that bracelet onto the shirt and then you're gonna twist and cuff the shirt in I think I'm doing this right. and then you're gonna tuck this under oh. <laughs> fail All right, let's try this again so you're gonna tuck this in all the way up. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I'm just gonna look in this camera here so I can see what I'm doing. And then you're supposed to twist this, right? And bend this over, under, or something. You're supposed to have like a little loop thing here happening. Okay, so clearly this is not happening. But what I would actually do with this shirt, is do it the old school way. 
Let's do it the old school way. All right, so I literally just kind of like twist this shirt, sleeve in the bottom, and then tuck it in. I'm gonna pull the sides down as to how much I want it, All right? So you have a like, little crop situation going on. Just gonna put on these Manolo Blahniks again. So you could do two things with this top. You could either crop it at the back and tuck it under, or crop it at the front here. Okay, so I switched it around to the back. I tied the back instead, tuck it under. I think I prefer it that way. So instead of having the shirt look boxy, it kind of just, you know, kind of bring it together, make it a little bit more fitted. Straighten this up. And it still looks really good. And with like cute little heels, it still takes it to, the, to another level. And I decided to go with my Chanel Boy, which is more of a casual bag. And we all know red, black, and white goes well really together. And it still looks really, really great. So this is a cool little way to kind of like elevate your t-shirts. I think a lot of people wear their t-shirts this way. It's nothing new. <laughs> I wanted to try the TikTok thing, but clearly that was a fail. But yeah, easily dress it up with your bag, cute shoes, and just bring the t-shirt jeans look to another level. And I loved how it turned out. Looks really great. Let me know what you guys think about this look in the comments or any other trick <laughs> to kind of like enhance a t-shirt. Okay everyone, there you have it, my H&M Casual Summer Top Haul, uh, featuring these really cute, simple, inexpensive tops from H&M. I love shopping at H&M. And if you're looking for some really quick tops, these are some great options. H&M has a ton of options. Um, please leave any relevant comments down below in the comment box, especially fun ways to style like t-shirt tops. I'm so not a t-shirt girl, but I tried this one and I did like it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like my videos, and when you subscribe, please hit the bell notification button. That way you will get an alert when I do upload a new video. And so I shall see you guys in the next video. Bye.